Hi, Nettie. Yes. How are you? Good. How are great you to see you. Good to see you too. Thanks for inviting Beautiful me over. Beautiful sister-in-law. How are you? Yeah. <laughs> I am great. What are you cooking me? We've got a range of four new products, 30-minute yeah. meal bases. This is the One Pot Mexican. Mm -hmm. So it's really, really authentic, lovely Mexican flavour. A little, just a touch of heat. And just a really good family meal yeah. that everybody will devour. And you, if you've got any leftovers, it'd be great for lunch the next day too. One Pot Mexican, 30 minutes, easy. So I'm yes. gonna show you. So we'll put that, we'll just put that sort of mid, mid heat. A couple of tablespoons of Berenberg olive oil. Beautiful olive oil from the limestone coast. Beautiful. All right. Really, we're just going to be browning off the onion and the meat. In goes the onion. We've got 500 grams of beef mince. So okay. I'm going to put you to work here. So you mentioned it's quite mild because I've got a little Lily at home. Yeah. She's um, not a big fan of the chilli, so it hasn't no. got a really hot chilli. No, not at all. No. It's family friendly and I've tested these out, out on my kids and they love, they love them. So, yeah. Excellent. Yeah. I want to get What's you to next? make up some um, stock. Okay. So we need 200 mils of beef stock. So it's yep, put in so a, a heap teaspoon. teaspoon. Yeah. And I have this dream about making stock at home <laughs> one day <laughs> in the future <laughs> when I have time. So we're just going to do 200 Two cups mils. of hot water. That's So I'm just popping the sauce in. Doesn't that look good? It looks amazing. It smells good too. I've got yeah. an idea. That jar, mm -hmm. you know, sometimes you want to get everything out. Yeah. Um, and I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure I read it on there that if we just add a little bit of the leftover stock, I saved a bit. Yeah. Pop perfect. it in there and then perfect. give it a bit of a shake up. Yeah. And then that's the way we get it out. This is a good trick on how to get the most out of your... Nice one. Jar. Beautiful. Pour that in. Mm-hmm. Easy. Excellent. Thank you. What? We're going to put a can of sweet corn because we've got to have the veggies in there. And now I'm going to put in a can of black beans. Yep, beautiful. Just get them from the supermarket. So we're going to just pop the lid on. Okay. And simmer pop for 20 on. minutes. All right. <laughs> Here's the lid. Nice work. Beautiful. All right. 20 minutes. Okay. It's simmered for 20 minutes, so yep. I think it's ready. So look, I know people are going to do whatever they like. You can get taco shells or burritos, fajitas. But I'm just going to serve it up like this in a nice sharing plate. And then we're just going to dress it up nicely. So it's up to you, really. How do you dress it? Do you want to pop some of the avocado on? Yeah, sure. Bit of tomato. Make it nice and colourful. Or you can just all have the things separately. Yep. Okay. Nice. All right, let's do a big blob of sour cream. A couple of corn chips. Beautiful. Okay, so are you a coriander person? Yeah, I love it. Coriander really does divide people, doesn't it? Yeah, it does, doesn't it? I oh, love it. Sour cream. I love it. I reckon people would love a bit of shredded cheese on this yeah, uh, or what else would you put some salsa and if you don't like sour cream you can use a bit of great yogurt oh that's a good idea yeah yeah, yeah. Okay. so let's taste this let's have a taste and all right get all the flavors let me together. know what you think okay mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. good it's delicious yeah good yeah wow that was what we set out to do mm. with this range is to make it really really authentic lovely delicious and pretty flavors. and pretty of I like course. pretty yeah I like serving up something pretty so there we are one pot Mexican quick easy delicious 30 minute meal from the Berenberg family farm to your family table thank you so much for coming thanks Sal <laughs> thanks for having me